Hello everyone, in this video I will give an overview of our work, All of Me, mining user attributes from their public Spotify playlist. I am Pierpaolo Tricomi from the University of Padova, Italy, and this is a joint work with my university and a startup named Spritz Matter. Nowadays, almost everyone listens to music. This is also thanks to the growing popularity of music streaming services like Spotify. Indeed, the platform has more than 500 million users and provides the possibility to create and publicly share playlists, fostering social connection and music spreading. From the literature, we know that music preferences, like the genres of artists people listen to, can be linked to personal attributes, such as the age or personality traits. For instance, the emerging singer Billie Eilish is mostly listened by teenagers. So the question we are trying to answer here is what if the public Spotify playlist will reveal private information of the listeners? Obviously, if this is the case, there will be far-reaching implications, ranging from the possibility to deliver highly personalized content to the risk of undermining user privacy. So what we're trying in this paper is to link Spotify playlist information to people private attributes. Practically, we collected people attributes through an informed survey and downloaded their public Spotify playlist. Using this information, we trained a machine learning model so that by giving an input the Spotify playlist of an unknown target user, the model will reveal their private attributes. We ran our experiment on a dataset of 739 users, comprising more than 10,000 playlists made of around 200,000 songs and 55,000 artists. We extracted features from artists, song, genres, and other general information. As target private attributes, we focus on demographic information such as age and gender, habits such as sport-related information, and personality traits. We tested five models over 16 attributes, and we were able to predict 15 of them statistically better than a random guess. For instance, we predict the gender with a better F1 score of 17%, sport habits with 11%, or openness with 15%. So if you want to know more, we encourage you to read the paper. But the takeaway is that more work is needed to protect user privacy on Spotify and that other music streaming services could be at risk too. Thank you.